Welcome back to Vivi. Uh, maybe it's not such a joyful occasion. Well, after waking up from a long slumber, well, intermittent long slumber. Well, Project Singularity does seem to have hit a road bump because, well, most of the humans are starting to succumb to the benevolent AI overlords. There was only so much that Vivi could have managed, and of course tracking down every single occasion that could lead up to the explosion of this kind of violence would have been a bit tricky. They focused on some things, but obviously something slipped through the net. It wasn't quite... wasn't quite factored into the equation. But since we are dangerously close to the end, Vivi is yet to sing. Can she make anyone happy? I don't like that countdown. We're headed off, headed off onto the bad end. Sunrise crashing to earth, leading into the... Okay, the AI island, back into Ophelia. Though things have changed, the progression of events of the world still continues on. And we still reach the conclusion... Oh shit. Starting off with the... Well, ending the timer on the... On the kid. And like that, in a flash, in the briefest of moments... La la la. Uh, <laughs> All of the a uh, I mean that's definitely one way to stop them. They've gone past diplomacy. Immediate fear of all AIs and will lead into his untimely demise. I mean, I think that's like quid pro quo. This is the exact like whenever you've got some immediate fear, run away from your savior. Uh, they then immediately get dispatched off. Hey, Matsumoto. I see you're better than public transport. Currently. Depends on the situation, really. It appears as though everything they have done hasn't led to the better f betterment of the future. Something wasn't calculated. It has occurred just as it ha has always been. But also, the, f the fact that they're all humming the same tune, it got me to, to remember, I guess, the fact that all of the AIs are kind of built off of this a few base models Vivi being the predecessor to so many of them you know, the original songstress AI which spawned off a load and also the way that all the kind of data is shared and the like it's not surprising that there's a vast spreading of uh, a singular idea murder And maybe it's just pest extermination.
But uh, being a song that we've heard so many times. Whenever you have a slightly calming... That is a very... Auto-tuned little voice there. As we've seen these shots before, are they reoccurring exactly as they once did previously? Understanding all of the, the background to all this, and it is just cyclical in nature almost, even with small changes. With Matsumoto. Professor Matsumoto. If he seems fine, if one can like emit signals of AIs, could you trick the AIs into thinking you're one of them so they don't attack you? Zap. And if they can incapacitate one without killing it, could they connect with the with the plug? See if they can get something. Which led into this. You've already tried it once and it was a failure. Well, yeah, about that. I mean, her mission of singing and making people happy hasn't exactly been... has been a... Uh, uh, the sole source of her pain. If it was not for the events that she's been forced into thanks to the Operation Singularity and being sent back in time or having the information sent back in time. And I think they originally had such a connection with Diva that you know, I place the trust in all of humanity into you for the for the future that may or may be. I didn't think I'd be hearing that name again anytime soon. And with surveillance cameras being almost as bad as in London, the AIOs can easily track down pretty much anyone. Yet yeah, you don't... You don't want to trip over. Ah... Yeah, I'm sure he's fine. Just having a metal ball with high, with high velocity slam into the back of his head. And he's about to get shot, isn't he? We have 
some more close combat hand to hand destruction. And another AI that's not contaminated. We've seen the like the 3D turn style, turntable animation. He seems to be having fun. A, a few times it's kind of difficult to pull off right, but having the somersault one, hmm. Physically, just a few minor scrapes and bruises. Emotionally, Hmm. And yeah, they're not immediately attacking you, but the distrust in AIs now is through the roof. Uh, yeah, I'm sure she has the immediate control and authority over all of the AIs. And why would he do that? Well, yeah, he can't exactly have a full-blown conversation with just the sounds of ricochet. Who is that then? If you got the like brief recollections, ah, I don't remember the. Well, that's very quick at picking that up. I mean, even if it was a failed plan before we were in the you know, timeline two, or potentially more, depending on how many times this has gone on. We were in, uh, yeah, in a second timeline. Isn't it better now that you've at least got Diva on your side and Matsumoto helping out? It's a like better place than you might have been. You can't just leave them out on the out on the streets. But what exactly is the the reason they've all suddenly snapped? The idea of uh, out-of-control AI and whatnot, I believe I said right at the beginning, is nothing new. And it's a story of... I can't say it. <laughs> Imagine being so self-centred that you'd name a, an AI after yourself and give it its own... Personality. Sense of identity. Grandfather. Well, I suppose the yeah, time has gone. They've had a few meetings, if it's who I think it is. The original... Uh, original member of the team. With a scar across his face. Elizabeth. So she didn't go down. She didn't go down to the ship fully. Where's an AI? Okay. <laughs> you may say that.
So what I was saying is a thing and is possible. Just backing up into a... Into a separate body. Pass on the main data that makes up an AI's consciousness. I mean... Let's hope she gives better... A better, um... A better response than she gave to the uh, the guy after the island. Oh, hey. Just in case, you leave a message just in case... I see there's a slight February 8th. Because we were told, you know, the, he got a revelation. So it's not the first and only one that has been sending shit back. What's with Matsumoto's little glare? Every second they spend here is more human life being lost. I see she hasn't exactly changed. <laughs> They're getting on fine. Well, anywhere that is AI, or AIs reside, of course there'd be rampant destruction. So all of their actions have been for naught, really. He knew about uh, some sort of event. Looking back to see what can be done to to prevent, to change, to hold off. What if they were just looking in the wrong place? Since his first day. What happened on like day one of employment? To be like, oh shit, AI is going to kill us all. There's a vending machine, eat his money. I say that's, that calls for a genocide. Some communications have been hard to get through. Yeah. So, somehow, you know, being spread across all of the AIs, having them as shared. Well, technically, you both did until the sunrise went. <whistles> so. She was doing her mission thoroughly and effectively, if you're talking about your sister. Hmm. 
Not going to say that the, they were together in that moment as well. Would that make her feel better? Very good question. Why are they... Was she cut off from any... Uh, she's just obstinate. <laughs> He didn't update her. Well, there you go. There's the answer. Never updated. Put... Put onto the archive. All of the old ones not connected to the archive. They're all fine. So we've got the central cause. Just take a crowbar to it. I'm sure, that'd be fine. Oh god, the siren's been called. Why do we have satellites? At least you got 12 hours. Using everything in the... Uh, at the exposal... Hang on, but isn't Viva slash Diva connected to the archive, so why is she... exempt? Oh. Why? The current human race. So what about future or... or alternative human race? Are, are, they ex are they fine from uh, destruction? Hopefully uh, Vivi doesn't uh, immediately find a new Prime Directive. And having Vivi's song be sung out, having Vivi as one of the original kind of antiqu antiquated in antiqu old models, But having us on connected to the archive, having it spread out across them all. Why? If like a shared database archive thing is the thing, is the bit that is changing. Their main goals from uh, let's sing, make everyone happy, or let's provide service, make everyone happy, or let's. Well, pretty much do any of the AI tasks to destroy all humans. Why is Vivi left out? Is it because of the sending back in time? Is it because of the split Vivi Diva? Now, the initial. Oh my god, it's an AI! Quick, kill her. We can't trust her. We got sorted out pretty quickly. I thought there'd be a little more pushback towards getting Vivi on board because, you know, well, the AIs are going amok. But I guess since they do have Elizabeth being next to their leader as a... Oh, well, there is precedent for a non-hostile one. Also... I see Toark are uh, following the same playbook as I am. Don't update shit. I believe my phone has an update from... Uh, 
Oh God. Apparently over six months ago and still not done. At least I know that most of my things will be safe from any sort of incidental anomaly leading to massive loss of life. Or just a removal of features or bloatware. That's annoying too. Imagine if all of the AIs came with some sort of monetization. Thank you for coming to Neil and listening to my performance. Now here's a message from our sponsor. Please pay for the full version to remove this message. <laughs> and also now knowing that the archive itself is the origin point of the outbreak of violence. The archive, the collect, the collective knowledge of all of the eyes, their experiences, their past, etc., etc. Everything that Vivi has been through has been collected and collated into the very thing they were trying to stop. So it was a losing game ever from the beginning because sending the uh, Help Humanity Directive right back to D.Va. She connects to the archive. The archive now knows about it. Oh, okay. It just took a while. For some reason, at 18 April, for, for the on switch to be flicked. We like to think that we would put up a good fight, would come back with some sort of ingenuity in order to stop all of the AIs, but for the majority of people, everyone would be shit, wouldn't they? I mean, the military wouldn't be able to mobilise quick enough. Most civilians would run around, die, hide. Maybe in that order. <laughs> The only benefit we really have is the you know ingenuity, thinking outside the box. We're not tied by any sort of algorithm, so that we can we can pretty much do anything. And also, we won't be taken down by a dose of electromagnetism. Maybe should we ever become re overly reliant on AIs in our daily life and androids and the like, maybe everyone should carry around a little. Personal Protective EMP. Has your Android run amok? Or look no further. Thanks to the patented, branded Tesla shock button, you too can be protected from the very products that you bought. And while we've seen stories and... Or any sort of uprising when they're fighting back against... Well, in this case, humans, but some form of oppression or whatever, there's always, there'd be a reason, there'd be something to really kick it off. The humans in this world, apart from a few factions trying to cause a bit of division, haven't really done anything major as far as I can tell. Enough to be like, oh well, humanity needs to be stopped f to be protected from themselves. I don't think any like major world wars have occurred in Vivi. Maybe there's some conflicts and whatnot because of the the need for lots of silicon materials you would find. What's the battery life of an android? How much lithium is in the world of Vivi? Maybe there is a big resource war going on just behind the scenes. That idea isn't it exactly new. We need to er eradicate all humans because, insert reason number 412, but when you have a centralised intelligence archive thing connecting all of your machines, well, actually like we have now, kind of, if they're able to push out an update which includes a new core reason for their existence, all we really need to do is get in there, change that, upload something else, and poof. there you go, you've bricked the system. But as we saw now, this is this is not the first time round, it's not the first rodeo. The 
attempt to save the future has already been made, sent back Vivi, that's why we went on the journey with her. But I had a thought which was, maybe this isn't the first time, at all, anywhere close. The, th the first attempt, sent it back, Vivi couldn't complete the mission, got stopped somewhere nearby, somewhere along the journey. And reached this conclusion, send back, send back. Send back. So there'd be an infinite number of regresses of VVs that never actually made it to this particular scene. All I know is that now we are basically just trying to mitigate the disaster, mitigate the loss of life, mitigate the damage caused to cities across the world. But since also time travel is a big thing now, maybe there's something we can do with that? Didn't work once, but, you know, quite some sort of plan to stop the archive bef well now that you know it's the archive now that you know it's the archive send VV Matsumoto back a bit don't get it to connect to it and share the information figure out a plan how to take it down done nice we can go home for tea but if you've been enjoying VV and the sorrow that has been brought recently I don't think we'll be happy through singing for a while, but you never know. If you've enjoyed, let me know. Leave a like and a comment on the video, subscribe to the channel. If you want to see more, it's always a good shout. Maybe join onto my Discord if you want to have a chat or something. We're actually growing quite a lot. There's far too many of you. I really don't understand why you're there. Still don't quite get why anyone watches. It's a mystery. Take care of yourselves, though. I'll see you in the next one. If you would all like to sing to the same tune and become one of the main master plan, which is, of course, to sit at home and just watch anime, because it's a lot more enjoyable than overthrowing the status quo of the world. Plus, you would be in good company of the likes of Noku, Raywin, Sal, Arthia, Kite, Shiwan, Mats, Gurley, Cardboard, Megu42, Dark Shadow, 7899, Akini, Tori, Jane, Wadi Saeed, and everyone else. So until the day comes that I travel back in time and warn myself of any sort of impending danger, I guess we can carry on as though everything is fine.